the sunshine is shining today in Blackpool. To see 25 stunning vehicles down the seafront at Blackpool in the sunshine, it was really a sight to be beholden. We're quite good at putting on a show here in Blackpool, as you know, and everything was ordered with military precision this morning, out of bed and here for half past six. Today we're launching 25 of our new buses, Enviro 400 City, provided by Alexandra Dennis. These are a new model, so we've got sociable seating around tables and we've got USB charging points as an extra um, addition up there as well. We have a five-year business plan and that plan is to renew every bus in the town by the year 2019 and then make sure there's never a bus more than five years old. So we're keeping on top of technology and what customer requirements are and uh, ADL so far are really coming up with the goods. They're a great company because they're very customer focused, they listen and they're ahead of the game. Alexandra Dennis, our partners, have embarked on this journey with them and the buses last year, they received the highest praise from our drivers, our customers and our stakeholders. These new vehicles focus on the youth of today. If you look on these vehicles today, you see our social seating layouts, There's three tables upstairs. There's USB chargers on the back of every seat, so everybody's got access to charge the phones. Panoramic windows upstairs with the sky view at the rear and it's absolutely stunning interiors. I'm absolutely delighted to be standing here today in what is a very exciting afternoon for Blackpool. Passengers will benefit more from the experience of the ride. Today marks the second stage of our investment programme, which is supported by Blackpool Borough Council to modernise our bus fleet and provide buses which the residents of Blackpool can be proud of. Well, they're totally accessible if you've got disabilities, if you're a mum with children, um, elderly, if you're young and vibrant. They're accessible for all different ranges of people. We'll be turning over buses year on year, we'll be keeping ahead of technology, we'll be environmentally friendly and we'll be employing lots of people. We employ 600 people in the town. Transport's got a future here.